he's like, oh. And speaking like, of Excalibur, up next, we have AEW CEO, GM, and Booker, Tony Khan, with a special announcement. You mean that guy? Yeah. Man. And I'll take it to the ring with the special announcement. AEW Tony Khan, blah, 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 blah. Do you Do you hear when he does that? When fucking... Excalibur right. fucking just goes where it's like, dude, why why are they forcing him to do that? Like, just announce some of the shit on Twitter and then let him say some of the shit on the show without fucking exploding his head trying to fit it all in. Anyways, it just goes into what we said last show. Tony Khan just fucking jam packs everything. Like, even the fucking reads, bro. It's like, okay, we get he's a speed reading champ or whatever, but god damn it. Like, give I can't even process all the shit you said. Like, oh, cool, he can say that. Okay, guess what, bro? This ain't a fucking spelling bee or a reading challenge or whatever the fuck you want to call it. Like, this, I, I can't even process all the shit you're saying anyways. Tweet some of it out. Anyways, I'm in a bitter-ass mood today, I think, about AEW. <laughs> I'm loving it. I'm, I'm burying the shit out of this show. I'm sorry, folks, listening to this. I really, usually, usually I'm putting the shit over to Hairline, but he's, I'm, it's just, this week rubbed me the wrong way for some reason. Um. And just like you said, I was happy to get into some fucking um, wrestling there. Tony Khan makes this announcement. Um, So backstage, which, okay, I'll let you go in on this. This was such like Tony Khan should not be on camera. He should not have a fucking microphone in his hand and he needs to appoint somebody. Correct. You got Jeff Jarrett there. You appoint somebody who's an asshole who can be an on screen. You had William Regal there. Make them your fucking commissioner of AEW and stop being he a ruined. fucking mark. He Go chased ahead. off William Regal pretty quick, bro. Yes, he did. Okay. Now um, so sorry. I'm calling Tony a billionaire mark, dude. I'm I'm and I'm a mark. I'm just going crazy today. So so the op- I pop for this, just uh, I pop for the announcement. Um again. I didn't need Tony Khan to tell this to me. It would have been awesome if, like, Bret Hart presented your guys' world heavyweight title. What if you got him to announce this or some shit? But he probably won't fuck with you guys um, based on recent comments. But anyways, the opening ceremony of this year's Owen Hart Cup will take place at Double or Nothing in Las Vegas. The tournament will be held in Canada. The tournament finals will take place in Owen's hometown of Calgary. So I will be present for this tournament. I'll be present for this more than yeah. likely. Um, so that'll be awesome. Um, I pop for this. Uh, it's great. The AEW tournaments usually suck. Hopefully they let Ethan Page or a Canadian win this fucking thing. Um, and, and I don't mean like the AEW tournaments, like the matches suck. It's just the formats suck. They come out of nowhere. People, like, I don't know, even just this recent Four Pillars tournament, but really tag team match to a fatal four. Like, it's just so, like, they don't mean anything let Adam Cole and Britt Baker both won last year's. They both won their respective tournaments. Shocker. <laughs> and I'm just ranting and raving hairline. I got to let you get a word in on this. I apologize, but um, okay. I'm- pop pop for Owen Hart. I, uh, res- all respects to the Hart family. Bow down, bow down, goats. But ultimately, Tony Khan should not be on TV. That's my only thoughts coming out of that fucking whole announcement. You go ahead. Man, I want to start with there was zero crowd reaction to this. I agree, because no one gives a fuck about Canada, especially right. not in Florida, and no one oh. gives a fuck about, um, I don't know, this weird tournament was just to give Britt Baker and Adam Cole, like, Tony Khan has some weird thing for them or something. Sorry, you go ahead. I already talked so much. I don't want to keep... I'm going to get us canceled. I'm going to get us canceled talking on this episode, dude. I'm going crazy on these motherfuckers. Sorry, you go ahead. I'm loving this episode, bro. <laughs> can't wait to see. I can't wait to see the Photoshop. Anyways, man, uh, I thought it was really cute. Also, how Tony paid for the the New Japan footage of uh, <laughs> so, like what a mark, bro. <laughs> you don't think they supplied it because of their like partnership? You don't no. think that's part of the no, contract? No, no, no. You know, they hustlers like Taz, and they worked them out of that. They're like, oh, <laughs> oh my. Dude. Uh, you want to hear some canceled shit? Watch this. Oh, we work Tony Khan. We get him to pay. <laughs> oh, no. oh, no. Airline. <laughs> <laughs> he, he got mocked. He loved, he oh, loved this stuff. God. He loved this stuff hard. He paid for it. Oh, Make him God. example. Anyway, so next up we had Wardlow. 